Imagine this, you can take any character you like and have it imitate everything you do. Every gesture, every body movement, every facial expression, and even your lip sync will match perfectly. Whether it's a 3D character, a superhero, a cute cartoon, or a fantasy creature, your actions become the character's life, making it move and express exactly like you want. And the best part, you can do all this without learning complicated 3D animation, no extra software, plugins, or complicated setups. The tool we'll be using is Runways Act 2, and this powerful feature lets you animate or completely transform any character using your own recorded performance, so your movement, facial expression, even lip sync get transferred perfectly to your character. So let's jump straight into it. We'll start by looking at the feature overview, the best practices, the results and observation, and creative tests and its limitations. To access Runways Act 2, come over to Open at AI. Here, select the video icon and now click on the menu icon to open the secondary menu. Once the secondary menu opens up, select Motion Sync Video and this interface will open up. On the Modo section, we can see Runway Act 2. And on this section, this is where we need to upload either a video of our character, an image of our character, or a character itself, and that's if we designed it in OpenAt AI. And on the second bar, this is where we can upload a reference video that our characters must imitate. We can either select a video, that's if it's saved into our PC, or we can record the video inside OpenAt AI. You can record yourself acting a scene with gestures or even dramatic moves, then import a character image or video. The AI transfers your performance to that character, bringing it to life with realistic motion, lip sync, and and expression. Now, as you're recording your video to get the best results, number one, keep your face clearly visible throughout the clip. And number two, frame yourself from at least the waist up. And number three, use good lighting so the model can pick up details like eyes, mouth, and subtle facial expression. At the time of recording this video, you can only create up to 30 seconds clip in standard aspect ratio. Click record video, allow camera and mic access, and hit record. Do not be shy, exaggerate your gestures a little. It helps the animation look lively. When you're done, hit confirm and your clip will be uploaded automatically. I will click on cancel because I already created some videos that I'm going to use for this example. On the expression intensity, you can select between one up to five. With one, you get less motion into your video and you can go all the way up to five. That's if you want to intensify the motion in your video. Most scenes look great between one and three, but experiment and see what best works for your video. We'll leave it to three in this example. Now that we are done with the feature overview, let's dive into some best practices. So I have this video that I prepared specifically for this tutorial. Let's play it. This is a beautiful attire or outfit suitable for our story and our character. Okay, you get it. I will upload it. Once it's uploaded, now before I show you a smooth way of creating your animations, let's start by uploading an image of our character. Select upload. I have this image of an alien which I generated in Leonardo AI. From there, we select create. And once our video is generated, let me play it for you to see how everything looks. This is a beautiful attire or outfit suitable for our story and our character, except it has a manic inside, which we have to remove to get that perfect outcome when our character will be wearing the dress. This is a beautiful... <laughs> this is just so amazing. If you've reached this far and you're enjoying what you're seeing, consider subscribing because more value awards you. I know that our character is cut a bit on the head and the arms are hidden and the AI could not display the hands for some reason, maybe it's because they're hidden, but the overall lip sync is just amazing and the body movement, just like the way I move in my videos and the lip sync is just on point. Now, for smoother animation, your character's first frame should match the pause in your performance clip. Here's a quick trick. Pause your performance video at the very first frame and take a screenshot and use it as a reference image when generating your specific character. This is the first frame of my performance video. All I do is grab a screenshot, come back to open at AI and select image and open it in a new tab. 
From there, select a mode that you would love to use by clicking on the switch button. I'll leave it on Seed Dream. From there, I upload an image that I just screenshot. From there, I can say a stunning 3D green alien and hit create. And here is the image of the green alien. It has managed to keep the entire background, the table setup exactly like it is in my reference image and just changed the character to exactly what we had described. We go back to Runway Act 2 and we upload the image that we've just generated from our history tabs and we hit create. And uh, this will be the results. Let me play the video for you to see exactly how it look. This is a beautiful attire or outfit suitable for our story and our character, except it has a manic inside, which we have to remove to get that perfect outcome when our character will be wearing the dress. I love how the motion and how well it imitated the reference video. I converted my image into a 2D anime and these were the results it generated for me. This is a beautiful attire or outfit suitable for our story and our character, except it has a manic inside, which we have to remove to get that perfect outcome when our character will be wearing the dress. Now, besides talking, I tested out some gestures and how well it can imitate. So I gave it uh, this video of this pretty lady and my character and these were the results besides my character being in a different posture my character imitated exactly what the lady was doing now let's push it a little bit further i have a reference video of this beautiful lady dancing we upload it and we select a character from our character's library from there we hit create now here are some of the limitations that runway has in most cases it struggles to capture fast or dynamic movements accurately like in this scenario that you can see in most cases if you are imitating from a fast past video actions often appear to be choppy or slightly off time which makes the motion feel less realistic compared to the original footage while the ai struggles to replicate or imitate a fast high energy movement from a reference video it actually performs really well with slower smoother motion subtle gestures and gradual actions tend to come out more natural and accurate and at the time of recording this video you cannot have multi characters in one scene but you can create individual scene then later combine them and not only that but when your face is a little bit further from the camera or in a different angle the ai usually does not detect the face hence giving you this feedback that says no face found but when it comes to imitating slow motion and simple gestures lip sync the ai does a great job more especially for ai avatars and character driven shots i would create an in-depth tutorial where you can generate animated scene using this method so stick around because you don't want to miss out on this one if you have any question or challenge hit me in the comment section below i would love to hear from you what do you think about this too god bless you